One Bradenton couple says the spooky show must go on even after a code violation forces them to tear down part of their haunted house. Brad and Jessica Myers first converted the yard into a house of horrors two years ago. Last year they saw their scare factory as potentially money machine for charity and began accepting donations to the Safe Children Coalition and Canned Foods. This year they're continuing the trend, getting neighborhood teens involved and hoping to raise even more money for a good cause. But the project hit a snag last week when Bradenton inspectors said a freestanding structure built in the driveway was in violation of city code. Meyer says they work with friends over the weekend to move it to the backyard and their terrifying project is back on track. It's just good for the neighborhood kids, you know, and adults. It's something as a family that they can come do and it's safe. It keeps um, the teenagers from the high school. They come and they help out and they actually, you know, are, are hunters. They're volunteers and it keeps them out of trouble. The Haunted House opens October 17th and runs every weekend through Halloween from 7 to 10 p.m. on Friday and Saturday. A $5 donation with proceeds benefiting the Safe Children Coalition is required for entry. The Haunted House is located at 3512 York Drive, West in Bradenton.